Yeah! Yeah! Hey, yo, what's up, guys? It's time for me. Yeah! So, once again, skills and maps. Now, first, let's read the question. The scale of a map is 1 ratio 5000. They have derived this scale to the form of 1 ratio n. The distance between building A and building B on the map is 3.5 cm. Can we just take note that it's on the map? Alright? That means on the map, the distance between building A and building B when you measure with a ruler alright nice looking ruler here it's 3.5 cm okay. find the actual distance between building A and building B in meters so first things first we know that on the left hand side of the scale is map the right hand side is actual in real life they want the actual distance that means at the end of the day we want to see the answer on the right hand side okay so usually they will give the requirement somewhere in the text so let's look at the question again first of all let's just write the scale 1 ratio 5000 Right. If there are no units in a scale in the form of a 1 ratio n, what does that mean? It means that it's in cm. 1 cm denotes 5000 cm. Now here's the thing. They want the answer to be in meters. There are two ways we can go about it. We can change to meters first or we can settle everything in cm. Right? How about we just do everything in cm first? So next thing is how does 1 cm here become 3.5 cm all right what do we need to multiply to 1 to get 3.5 if we're not sure we can take this value here divide by this value here 3.5 divided by 1 will give us 3.5 again so 1 times 3.5 is equal to 3.5 left hand side anything that happens on the left hand side you will still need to do the same thing because it's a ratio on the right hand side times 3.5 so when you use your calculator you, you press uh, 5000 times 3.5 and you will, you will get 17500cm all right now you actually have covered the actual distance from your workings here now here's the thing the question here read the question carefully they want to they want you guys to express the answers your answer in meters so let's just change this cm to meter we do know that one meter is 100 cm right it's the size of your teacher's ruler in the classroom so how does you how do we convert 100 cm to one meter we have learned previously that the decimal point how many times does it move to become one it moves two times all right so we can apply the same thing to our cm to meter we can just use imagine that there's a decimal point here you move back divide two times divide by 100 and you'll get 175 meters yeah you feel me